we're exploring an extraordinary breakthrough in the development of brain-computer interfaces. This is a device made of living neurons that has been implanted into the brains of living mice. And Jeremy Sue is here to tell us about it. The traditional brain implants, you know, you're sticking those hard metal electrodes or wires into the brain. And, you know, anytime you do that, that really just carries some risk of destroying brain tissue and causing some brain damage. This new brain implant device is really interesting because they're using those soft, squishy living yeah. cells instead of just the hard electrodes. And that aims to sort of provide direct access to the brain in this less invasive way, while also harnessing uh, living neurons that can form these natural connections with the host brain. So for this very first experiment, the Science Corporation team first placed tens of thousands of neurons in these individual compartments, all kind of you know, arranged together in a single layer, effectively like a honeycomb uh, array. And that honeycomb array of all these living cells is on the bottom of their brain implant device. Then they installed the brain implant device on the brains of living mice so that the implant's neurons can kind of naturally grow out and connect with the neurons in the mice brains.